with his players better than he. Starting lineups, they've juggled a little on the Point Loma side. Welfringer, Weatherall, Campbell, Lundestad, and Ussery. The ball's in the air, and there it is, and who comes away with it? Point Loma. That's Welf uh, Weatherall, the uh, USD transfer, one of two, another one on the bench. Good pressure by the Aztecs, really putting the heat on defensively. Now, out of the corner, Rahan. And on the miss, with 14 and a half to have done so. Bill Carr in his second year. That's a nice young player. There's only one senior on this team. Well, I think he's shown that, you know, everybody can play at a high level. You feel that, you know, USD is not always the place or San Diego State. Seven the score point. of the ball game. The Sea Lions with seven in a row. Athletic, foulest defense that they can put on you. Deep shot by Weatherall in, out, and in. Like a politician in the race, in, out, and in. Got the open shot. It was a tough open shot, but he knocked it down. Weatherall hit that three ball, and that was a that was a good thing for the Sea Lions because they had, have not been getting a lot of. Keep in mind, also, that's coming out of a motion offense where you got the bigs coming down, setting screens, throw. Fantastic stroke. And they're going to need a big night from him, especially without the services of Jamal Franklin. In right. case you know, folks, has a tight lower back tonight. Let's have another big, uh, another big that can stretch what you call a stretch four out on the court right now. So welcome to the Montezuma Mesa, James Johnson. Steve Fisher actually called Bill Carr when he was thinking about bringing Johnson here because Carr had recruited him, as you mentioned, and Weatherall hitting a three for the sea line. Welfringer, of course, playing with a bad knee, so they didn't know how long he might be able to play tonight. He had two surgeries on his knee, and he's only been playing for three games. Almost a steal at midcourt by J.J. O'Brien. Weatherall on the top. Ushery in the corner. From Tony Gwynn in practice. I said, man, I like this guy. He finds me all the time. I used to do his game. So you'll see. And it's all about points. Uh, possession of the point you have. As you can see, the patience on offense. Finding the people inside. Giving San Diego State a little. He runs him over. Offensive foul. Well, you, you talk about the play right here. As you see right here, he comes off. He gets into the scene, draws a double team right here, kicks it off to the big who rolls in for the basket. I mean, this is just good basketball. Look at that. Wow. You feed off each other like that, Eddie. You, you know, you always your coaches say, keep the game simple. That's simple basketball. And kudos to that coach right there. I said offensive foul. I meant defected leader on the Point Loma side at six. He had Point Loma Nazareth has done in his first half at six to 12 from beyond the arc. That is a huge plus. Coming from inside, as you just saw them, good things happen. Stevens was shoved and not in the act of shooting, so thus they did not shoot the free throw. Lanes, which the Aztecs do very well in. Working the clock nicely. Weatherall, he's double on the way to the base, and he's fouled on the way coming down. So again, good patience by Point Loma, and Bill Carr is happy with that. He did that, now he earns a, free, a trip to the free throw line for two. There's Bill Carr, he was the head coach of the University of California, San Diego, UCSD, for four years, or three years, and then uh, an assistant under Bill Greer for, for, for three over at uh, USD. On January 4th, one of the best bowl games of January 4th, only on Fox. In the after Jamal Franklin, as J.J. O'Brien steals the ball and then loses it himself. Well, the defenses are getting a little tight, but the Aztecs on that last basket could already. Weather all. Faked like he was going up at the three. Gets it back. Pump picking the crowd. Leaves it down inside for Campbell. Take a look at that last play and the great execution here by Point Loma. The Aztecs played such good defense on this play, but give Point Loma Nazarin good credit. I mean, they finished and in here drawing the, the charge, taking the sacrifice with your body for your team. And you earned an opportunity to cut into this lead. These guys might not want to think that they're playing the 18th best team in the nation. I mean, just don't get yourself confused right now. They're doing a good job. Nice follow through. And he just stood there for a second and, and did the Statue of Liberty. Uh, he had been shooting that three ball beautifully. He had been uh, like 18 for 33. You know that a uh, little number here for you. The San Diego State is 41 and 2 the last 43 times it's held the opponent for 40% or less. Right now, Point Loma is shooting. Don't do it within rhythm. He had everything in rhythm that time. Beautifully done.
by Spencer, the nine. Aztecs with a lead, 7.50 to play here in the second half. Weatherall, drop lead feet, beautifully done. And Point Loma comes away from it on the strength of a Josh Richardson lay-in. The stretch four, he can step away from the basket and knock down shots. So Steve Fisher's gonna have to stretch his rotation as Weatherall hits the three ball.